So this is SwitchPod. In this video, I'm gonna show you eight different things that are great to know to get the most out of your SwitchPod. Any camera with a tripod thread, just like this, fits right on top. Tripod, tripod thread, pretty straightforward. All you need to do is collapse the legs of the switch pod and grab your camera and use the knob here to screw it right on. Just like that, you're ready to go. Now, if you're gonna use something like a GoPro, you're just gonna need to have a case on it that has a tripod thread at the bottom. Same with a smartphone. If you wanna put your phone on a switch pod, you just need something that's gonna hold that phone, hold it right in place there, has that tripod thread. The best way to have your camera mounted on a switch pod is when the legs are collapsed, to have the lens face in the same direction as the legs. Reasons twofold. Number one, when you're holding it out, it's facing you. Number two, when you set it down, the lens is supported by having a leg directly underneath it. So if you have a big lens on there, it's not gonna fall over. When you wanna switch between handheld and tripod mode, you can easily just hold the rightmost leg, give the other two legs a little flick, some momentum and some magnets will help you out and it'll open into that tripod mode. So practice a little bit and you'll be a pro in no time. We designed switch pods so that you'd have a neutral grip, no bend in the wrist when you're holding it, kind of like a hammer. I mean, you, you could use this like a hammer, I probably wouldn't, but I mean, you could. There's also enough room and finger grooves for you to kind of switch hands like this if you need a break or to choke up on a heavier camera or two hands, you're filming with that red camera. If you want more control angling your camera, you can actually attach a ball head right on top of the switch pod. It would just screw on just like a camera. Some ball heads might have a larger thread hole there at the bottom, so just know you might need a little adapter, which I'll link to below. Switch pod is made of aluminum, so it's super strong and durable, but it's also very lightweight. It has magnets in the top here to help it stay open and magnets in the bottom of the legs to help keep them together and closed. Then it has rubber feet on the bottom so that when it is in tripod mode, you set a camera down on it, it's not going anywhere. To add accessories to switch pod, like a light or microphones or something like that you don't want on your camera, but you want to mount to the actual switch pod, there are two quarter 20 inch holes at the top of the outside legs. We designed switch pod to be extremely lightweight so you could travel with it and it could fit anywhere, whether that's a water bottle pocket on the side of your backpack or you want to just use a carabiner right through the middle of the switch pod and attach it to anything. So now I know how to use switch pod. Any of the accessories, any of the things I showed in this video are linked down below. If you have other questions, email us at support at switchpod.co. And I've been Caleb Logic. I can't wait to see what you make with switch pod. Cheers.